Sports Highlights with me, the California Crusher, heavyweight champion of my own universe, brother. And I'm here to tell you mainly about Bay Area sports, because let's be honest, those are the only ones that matter, all right? Let's start on top with the swinging A's. They're number one in baseball, baby. Woo! You gotta love it. They sent six of their guys to the All-Stars. We had Yo-Yo win the Home Run Derby again. Yeah, I call him Yo-Yo, okay? You can call him Yo-Hannes Cespedes. All right, Chris Berman, that's how you say it. Yo-Hannes Cespedes. Not yo nananes ya yo nananes It's Yo-Hannes. yo Cespedes, all right? It's not that hard. Well, he's the Home Run Derby champ. We had six go to the All-Stars. Josh Donaldson was a starter. Derek Norris got a base hit, and he scored a run. And we got one more in some margin when we had the last-minute pickup deal before the All-Star break from the Cubs. Is it some margin? Is it some margin? Is that how you pronounce the name? Who knows? But anyways, he's a good pitcher. He's a big boy, and I like him. Our pitching st staff is deep. Malone, he's having troubles. He's a little butthurt that he got sent back down. He might leave. I want him to stay. Tommy, don't go, but you never know. The Angels are close, though. They're only two games back. You don't know what's going to happen. They got Pujols. They got Trout. They got some other good guys on the squad. And you know what? It might be close towards the end of the line. But luckily, the Rangers are out of it. The Mariners are out of it. Even though King Felix always just seemed to have the A's number. But the A's, I'm saying they're going all the way to the World Series. It's our year, brother. I was just recently at the 25-year reunion of the 89 World Series, and woo, it was electrifying. They had Conseco, they had Henderson. They had both Hendersons, actually. Ricky Henderson and Dave Henderson. They had the other Dave, Dave Stewart, all right? They had Eckersley. It was great. And you know what? The A's are just like that team. They find a way to win, and they will take it all the way. On the other side of the bay, we got the Giants. While they're plagued with injury, got a lot of guys off and on the DL. Hey, they're still in first place. And the Dodgers, for what they're spending down in L.A., they should be doing a lot better. So, Giants, thank your lucky stars. Even though you had a slump in June, you won four out of your five last games. And, you know, Sapien's going to make that power move towards the end of the trade deadline. You know he's that slickster that'll make that happen. All right? So don't count them out. And you know what? To be honest, I know other people have said it, but I'm sniffing for a World Series, another Bay Bridge Series. You know what's coming, brothers and sisters of California. You know you're going to love it. And as the California sun is my witness, it will happen. All right, let's move on to football. And we got the Levi's Stadium. We got a bunch of new stadiums coming up. The Warriors, we'll get there. The Warriors are building a new stadium in Mission Bay. Levi's Stadium, it's finally up and running. The crew that works the stadium, they've gotten the tours. They're starting to work there. And you know what I've heard? They don't even have enough parking there, brother. What's the deal? You got to park in Santa Clara Municipal Golf Course just to sit down in the stadium? You got to figure that out before you build the stadium. And now we're talking Raiders might play there? I, I, I just don't know how to say to that. How could the Raiders and the Niners play in the same stadium? That's just like unheard of. That's like oil mixing with vinegar. That's like, that's like uh, peanut butter with, uh, with spaghetti sauce. That's like uh, Miley Cyrus playing with Jimi Hendrix. It just doesn't compute, brother. I don't know how that's going to happen. And you remember when they banned the preseason Raiders and Niners games, right? Because of all the fights that happened in the parking lot? What's going to happen when they play in the same stadium? I don't know, brother. But you know what? They're fi the Niners, are, they're finally paying their, their quarterback a due payment. Kaepernick just got signed to a hefty deal, and we're proud of him. Raiders, well, you know, both teams are starting training camp. And so the thing you can be happy about the Raiders is a new season and they're starting off fresh and they've, they've got no losses yet. So you can only, you can only go down from here, but Raiders, we'll see what you do. Okay. Niners, I think you're doing good again, but you know what? You're not going to be the first ones playing the inaugural game at Levi stadium. Oh no, brother. It's the earthquakes, the MLS soccer team of San Jose. That's right. Wondolowski and crew will be playing there against their rivals, the Seattle Sounders. And that's going to be the first match in Levi Stadium. Their new stadium hasn't been built yet, but it'll happen, all right? And another earthquake news, if you caught all the little little fever of the World Cup, well, our boy, our East Bay boy, that's right, Wondolowski had the chance to kick another goal in the, in the World Cup, and he was 15 feet away, and he missed it. I don't know what happened. He hit high, he kicked it high, and Wando, I feel for you, brother. 
you know, when it comes down to it, I've been in those situations in the squared circle where you're just about to get the pin at the last minute. They come out with a chair and hit you over the head, and you miss it, all right? So I know what that's like. We're still cheering for you, and you're going to have a great season with the earthquakes. I know the Sharks are long out of it, but since this is the first sports highlight, i got to talk about them because, man, they were up against the Kings three games to none, and then they lost four games in a row. Come on. If that's not called a choke, you know what I call it since it's the Sharks? The Sharks bit it, okay? They bit it, all right? In honor of Shark Week on Discovery Channel, the Sharks bit it hard, all right? They lost a couple teeth in the process because that's what sharks do. They lose teeth when they bite. But you know what? They always seem to be in it. They always seem to be in the playoffs, but they never couldn't quite get to the Stanley Cup. I know things might change because there's talk of adding... There's talk of adding some ice girls to the rink. Oh, yeah, similar to like we have cheerleaders in football and basketball. There might be a little controversy from some of the women's groups in the Bay Area. But you know what? We got to do something to spark it up and to liven up the matches. You know, that just might be the answer. All right. We're going to finish up here with basketball, the Warriors. Because last season they went to the playoffs again with Mark Jackson. But in a shocking dismay, Lacob fired him he didn't like him he said you're too preachy you don't run enough plays i want my boy steve kerr in now the way it went down was a little shady crusher's not really down on that plus he's a player's coach steve steve curry liked him stephen curry liked him thompson liked him lee liked him the team liked him but kerr's the man he's from san diego he's a california brother he's got a daughter a cow you got a little east bay love berkeley love there and he will do it, all right? Clay Thompson, they don't want to give him up. We're trying to get Caleb because we need another good power forward. But you want to keep Clay Thompson. Well, Clay Thompson's good. He's got shooting. He's got some good defense. But come on, big man Caleb, what are you going to do? They're going to get a new stadium. It was going to be near the bridge. Now it's going to be over by Mission Bay. It's going to be luxurious. We can't wait for that to happen. But if you want to be honest with me, brothers and sisters, Oakland is the basketball town in the Bay Area, and that's where the Warriors need to stay. But if they move to the city, hey, you got the big money suites, you got the high price living, and that's what they're going for. Either way, the Warriors are on top, Bay Area sports are on top. I'm the California Crusher, and these are the sports highlights. Woo!